<laughs> I think it would have been on camera like. Well, I know you niggas wanted to talk about the Grammys. Oh. Yes. <laughs> yeah, actually, I do. Yes. For the, for the first time in history, mm, yeah. the Grammy for Record of the Year, Song of the Year. No, no, Album no. of the Year. Album of the Year. Oh, Album of the Year, too? Yeah. No, no, it's Album of the Year, you, you mean. Album of the Year has uh-huh. a very, very particular snub that we, we've never seen before. Yes. And nope. it's kind of crazy. <laughs> No crackers, bro. None. All well, no, no, wait, was it, was it no, no white, no men? white males. No Sorry, white no white males. males. There's a white female that made it, that made the nomination. Taylor Swift, I'm sure. No, Lord. Re- what? Yeah. Taylor Swift didn't make it? Too late, too late, too oh, late. Maybe next okay. year, maybe next year. I was about year. to say, the crackers But it's, it's Lord. It's Lord, uh, Charles Gambino, Jay-Z, Kendrick Lamar, and Bruno Mars, mm. all nominated for album of the year. You know, if they, if they, I hope Kendrick wins, dog. Yeah. And if Kendrick doesn't win and Bruno Mars wins, I won't be surprised. Honestly, I won't be angry either because I love Twenty Four. So, you, K so Gold. Y- your pick would be Damn. That's what. That's yeah, what you, Damn was an incredible album. Yeah, that was incredible. incredible. Damn was piece of work. I don't know. For me, I, I, I Childish Gambino's project. Yo, it, that was that you was. You know a why it was good? Too. That shit was amazing. You know why it was good? Not only because of quality, because also because it was different. Yeah, yeah. It, it was com- like it no trans- song sounds the same. Mm-hmm. His single. With some old school, um, I reminded me of what, some print shit, dog. Yeah, yeah. Honestly, reminded me of some like yeah, oh, red, bone. red bone. Yeah, yeah like yeah. which went two times platinum. By the way, that song is incredible. Yeah, two it, it, it sampled um, didn't it sample Bootsy Collins? Probably. It sounded yeah, like probably. that guitar riff. Easy, bum, Easy bum, E used that bum, sample bum, also. Yeah. yeah, on one of his albums. Yeah, hey, mm. hey. but yeah, shout out to the Grammys being black as ever. Yeah, you know man, I mean? black yeah. is probably gonna be for a while. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, so them W is gonna come back with a vengeance next we, year. We gonna, but bro, for this we, year, we're gonna celebrate. We the, gonna bask in this. The, yeah. What, gonna, what, was that gonna, cr- was a crit album too late for this year? Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. By the too way, late, late. phenomenal piece of yeah. work. Yeah. Yo, big crit. Put his ankle in that. I shit, want to put a hundred dollars on it right now. Mm. Show me a song where a nigga went harder than crit wedding confetti, dog. <laughs> that oh my god, that and shit it, was a. Open hand slap and a backhand slap what? to the hip hop game. Dog. First, first of oh, all, that nigga went the fuck in, dog. First of all, like in this time where niggas don't really do long albums anymore, mm. this nigga did a double album. Oh shit! This nigga did a I dub- know it was a double album. It was a double album. Yeah, that, shit. You know the the track Justin Scott. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's the start of the second. Of oh, the album. second album. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Cause it's like okay. the, it's one album supposed to be Big Crit, and the second album is Justin Scott. That's his real name. Oh yeah. Uh, yeah, so it's like one is like his is his, his um alter ego. Okay. And one is like all right, it talks it's more him. personal shit. So he went with the like the the slim shady, the T I versus T I P route. Or the yeah. or the suit and sweat, remember that? Yeah. yeah. You know I've oh, never listened to that. Don't even bring up suit and sweat. I've never listened to <laughs> <laughs> that. Was hey Nelly had the game on a uh, chokehold for him. He a did, but minute. suit and sweat was a was a loss, bro. <laughs> oh, it was a huge loss. <laughs> I didn't even listen up. to it, I just listened to the singles. I think but, um, Pimp Juice was on Pimp Juice was probably the best song. Yeah, Pimp juice. I remember that shit. Yeah, <laughs> fucking right. But um, back to the Grammys. Yeah, yeah. that's beautiful. Yeah. That you know, black people are being represented in such a way. Mm. And um, and W's probably mad. W's hella mad. Probably, but W's they're always mad. They are always mad because shit ain't about them, dog. Yeah, trust me. But um, the thing with this is, it's just showing that you know, there's talent elsewhere uh-huh. because that that was everybody's uh argument with it, like. You're only showcasing this guy and that guy when all these other guys exist. Mm. And that's why Chance last year was so important. Yeah. He opened up that SoundCloud portal, mm. mm-hmm. although there's also garbage along with it. But he still opened up that SoundCloud portal to tell everybody that doesn't know about SoundCloud and SoundCloud rappers that there's a whole bunch of other niggas out there, yo. Yeah. True. It's not mm-hmm. just... Uh, I'm gonna say Kendrick. It's not just Kendrick and Jay Z and Big Sean. It's other niggas out there that can spit. Yeah, true. You know true what I'm saying? Like, hey, can I? Can I? For, tell- for instance, Khaled. I'm not gonna go into but yeah. Khaled. Like, he was on Twitter saying, "I wish I could go to the Grammys." That is niggas nominated. Mm. Oh, on yeah, Twitter, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So about. you just gotta open that lane so more good shit can flow in. Right. But you know what I want to tell the people one time? I want to tell people <laughs> to give new music a chance, please. Cause a lot of a lot of y'all won't even entertain shit unless it's on the radio. That's an understatement. Or bro. if it's like being, you know, if, if it's popular, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Cause a lot of these people, a lot of these, what? Let me say, all these niggas that you love now, 
were once, you know, say niggas on SoundCloud trying to make it. Yep. And if they weren't on SoundCloud, it was at the local corner store slinging them CDs. Word. Oh, yeah. yeah. Word. Uh-huh, mixtape. So and niggas was and niggas was throwing out their mixtapes and niggas was not listening to their shit because they didn't hear it. Coasting. Yeah. People people are scared to try something new. Yeah. I, like it's it's. I, I I wonder about that. Like, why are y'all scared to just like listen to something new? Worst case scenario, you don't like it. Yeah, that's it. You don't listen to it again. Yeah, that's <laughs> it. Give it a chance because there's a lot of good music out there. Hey, and speaking of which, um, check out our SoundCloud because al- al- along with our episodes, um, we've been re- um reposting like you know different albums, different mm-hmm. mixtapes, and mm-hmm. stuff like that. So check out the music yeah. we post. It's all it's all people that you know. It's it's home team, local people exactly. with talent. You know what I'm saying? Out of Miami, out of South Florida, who doing something? You know what I'm saying? And we got a lot of time here, so give it a chance. Yeah, like I've been saying for a while, the talent down here is bubbling. It's about to boil over. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And hopefully we can, you know, we got represented in the Oscars recently with mm-hmm. Moonlight. Hopefully, mm-hmm. you know, a big Miami artist can, you know, be up for a Grammy. Sure. Hey, personally, but- I'm sure it's happened, but I don't remember the last time a Miami artist, like, from Miami. You know why? That's been up for a major Grammy. You know, I'm sure it's happened, but I don't remember. Honestly, not even a major Grammy, just just a major major music or artistic award. Period. True, true. I, I can't think of one that comes to mind. I true. mean, Khaled, but yeah, Khaled's kind of all over he's the place. An honestly, yeah, he's he, an affiliate. He's not really the artist. He's kind of the person who puts the artist. He's a together purveyor. In the room, yeah, you know what I mean. He's so, a purveyor. Well, yeah, you know, I mean, well, it, it, it might be, it might be, you know what I mean, on the forefront coming up shortly. So, well, yeah. definitely something to look out for. Well, and a big reason, like. Miami people don't support local artists, man. Oh man, that's the worst. That time's been changing, though. Oh, I mean, I, I say it's, this it, as hopefully as possible. That 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 culture has been changing. People are starting to reach across the table, mm-hmm. starting to work together more. It's hard to put people on a little bit more, but yeah. I mean, in general, yeah, we need to be on that that Atlanta shit where yeah. where a yeah. lot, everyone's working together, everyone's pulling each other and up. And putting or, your homeboys on. Once yeah. I get to this level, I'm trying to pull you up to that Word. level with me. We need to get to the point where like we need, we give niggas a chance, just straight off the chance that they straight off the strength that they uh, they from the crib. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Oh, he from the... I'm going to give him a chance. Exactly. We need to be on that. Exactly. Because people like literally would n- go out their way to not listen to your shit. For real. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, you you one of them local... Oh, you you a rapper? Oh, you... you. Once they... Like, Miami has had a culture, or South Florida has had a culture. It's like, if you not pop in already, mm-hmm. they're not going to fuck with you. Oh, boy. Repeat it for the people in the back, bro. Yeah. And it's, Say and it, a lot of for the people and, in the and back. That, and that shit is... That shit is... Up. Poisonous mindset, dog. Right. I, I'm, and niggas complain about why Miami isn't represented. It's like, no, it's because you don't support your Miami artists, dog. It's like, if exactly. you if you exactly. want to see artists from your city make it, you need to support artists from your city. Oh yeah, and speaking of artists from my city, shout shout out to um one of my homeboys that also rap. He always always hitting you up, always being over. I'll take one. Mm-hmm. Y'all haven't heard him, but you know I'll shoot y'all the link later. Right. But, um, the strip I, club? I, <laughs> exactly like the strip club. Hey, but um, yeah. Shout out, shout out, what Paul Morris? Shout yeah, out. shout out Paul. Our last. Oh yeah, shout, shout out. Sorry, shout, shout out to our last guest, Paul Morris. Word. He's straight out of Miramar. Shout Word. out to Take Mar. One Large. Word. Take One Lounge. Yeah. Shout out, <laughs> shout out to um, uh, Denzel Curry. Denzel Curry. Shout, shout out to Mark. King Negus. You know what I mean? King Negus. Star of Mar. Star of Mar. Shout Look out for that King Negus. Shout out to T Baby. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He, ju- he just um dro- dropped a single called Jump Man. That shit's hot. Um, who else? I mean, so, hey, shout out to all the home team. Uh, yeah, all the team home artists, team artists try uh, up and coming. Shit, shout out Ball Greasy, me. Zoe Dollars, Yo, Ball, Ball Greasy, Iceberg, Iceberg, you know, Iceberg too. If y'all can play him in the club, y'all can, you know, Word. do more than that. Come Rest on. in peace, Bizzle. R.I.P. Bizzle, lip biting animal. Word. Mm-hmm. R.I.P. Bizzle. P- Word. Real, Piccolo, one time. Nigga uh, in the lip. <laughs> <laughs> DJ Rhymer. You know what I'm saying? Ah. Uh. So all, all the niggas. So yeah, Chip Man, Chip Man, DJ Chip Man, with the beam in the eye, yeah. with the beam. Sam Sneak, Sam Sneak, Sam Squad, <laughs> <laughs> and of course, you know, even though he blew up, shout out to Ross, shout out to Gunplay, shout out to uh, excuse me, Flow Rider, Trina, Trick Daddy, word, whole triple C's, old slip and slide, Uncle Luke, 
You know, mm. what I'm saying? people that paved the way for us. You know what I'm it's not like we can't do this. We've Word. done it before. Word. We're Le- doing it now. Word. Rick Le- Ross is one of the biggest artists ever. Where Lex Luger on the on the on the produce side. You know, from Miami. No, nah, he's not from Miami. Cool and Dre is. Shout out Cool and Dre. Shall I see? Wait, wait, wait. Where's Lex Luger from? I think ATL. Yeah, I think he's from. Damn, but he. I want to say ATL. Like he makes beats for a lot of Miami niggas. You know what? Lex Luger might be from Miami. I wouldn't be surprised. And also, shout out to the uh, Flatliners. Like, it, it's, it's a lot of big Miami artists down here. Right. You know Up saying? and coming, who we got? We got uh, Denzel. We got Twelvin, mm. if I'm saying it right. Yeah. yeah. Tw- tw- I'd say Twelvin. Twelvin, yeah. yeah I, I'm not sure, but I've heard a few of his things, and, I, and I'm a fan. Word. Yeah. Shout out to um, Sylvan LeCue. Um, LeCue. Oh, yeah. Guest on the show, Sylvan LeCue. Shout yeah. out to Gabby Duran. Yeah. Uh-huh. We're going to have you on the show soon, sweetie. The sit tight. Oh, yeah. Uh, Lex Luger is from Georgia. Oh, uh, he was born in Virginia. Yes. yes oh, yes, yes, yes. Yeah, Silver Lecou did drop some work recently. Check that out. Word. And um, I, say it again. It's called Five Five Five. Five Five Five, 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 five. Sylvan. Yeah. One more than four, four, four. Sylvan Lecou. Word, word. Yeah, shoot. absolutely. Yeah, shout yeah. out, shout out to you, man. Appreciate, appreciate you come, being on the show. Check out that episode too. Um, that was a that was a pretty good episode. What episode was that? That was episode a lot of uh, a lot of time ago. But and we're gonna we're gonna pull it up. Yeah, we go pull it up. <laughs> but yeah, you know, all in all, I'm just glad the uh the Grammys are being represented in a way so it can, you know, represent everyone. Show the diversity of music. Exactly. Though. Because music there is a there. ton of it. Mm. I think music might be the di- most diverse uh genre down here. Yeah. <laughs> like right now it's music. It it, it could have been, you know. Oh, episode twenty seven. Mm. Sylvan LeCue, check that out. Oh man, he was there for early days. Yeah, we, you know, we was at uh this Tajara Tajara studio. Shout out to you. Well, hey, shout out Tajara. <laughs> yeah. Hell yeah. Shout out Cleo. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. 